Hello everyone, I hope you are doing well. And as you can see, I'm in the middle school and I'm going to start my class soon. And before the class uh, starts, I'd like to tell you about the Great Firewall of China. So this is the middle school, they have some event over there that they organized, big event. The Great Firewall of China is a double-edged sword. Double-edged sword. So why I love the Great Firewall of China? <laughs> so you see, um, Quite often I complain and I tell you, oh no, the great firewall of China, <laughs> I need a VPN, I cannot access Google, or the internet is so slow and sometimes the VPN, it won't work. So sometimes I complain about all this. But on the other side, yeah. <laughs> on, the, on the other side, it's like, uh, I also like the great firewall of China, because it means there is less competition. Let's take some example. If you, as a, um, as a U.S. national or as a European, you wouldn't, you want to access the Chinese internet, it means uh, it will be very slow because the server here is here, here he's here in China, and uh, if I am here in China, I will be able to access the Chinese internet. Of course, I won't be able to access uh, Google. I won't be able to access the Western internet. But if I'm here in China, I will be able to access the, the internet here in China. If you are not in China, if you are in the West, maybe you will be able to access the Chinese internet, but it will also be it's very slow. It will also be very slow. I think it's because the, the server are, are based in China and it needs, uh, the, the data needs to be processed from, uh, from where you are to China and then come back. And that's how it is. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, in fact, it's a double-edged sword because you can, as, as a foreigner here, you can access the Chinese internet, it means there is less competition. If uh, you are in your own country, maybe in Europe, maybe in the US, you want to access the Chinese internet, it will be very slow, it will be very difficult. Um, also, uh, if you want to use um, Western internet, if you want to use the Western internet, look at this, the construction, if you want to use the Western internet and um, you want to, uh, to use it together with some Chinese people, you won't be able to do so. But if, if you want, you need to know about the Chinese internet. For instance, you cannot use Skype anymore in China, except with the VPN. Uh, it means you need to know what's, what is the Chinese equivalent to Skype. For instance, you cannot use Facebook in China, except uh, with the VPN. So it means you need to know the Chinese equivalent to Facebook. You need to know all this. This is knowledge, knowledge not everyone has. It means there is less competition. There is less competition for you. Because other Western people, other foreigners, they don't know about uh, this. They don't know where to look. They don't know the Chinese internet, you see? So if you are in China, first of all, you can access the Chinese internet. Second, you will know about all this, uh, all this internet uh, application. And, and then you will be able to use it. And there is less competition for you. It means uh, more money for you, more job for you, more opportunities for you, since there is less competition. And I will leave you because my students are here. So take care. <laughs> And uh, see you next time. Bonjour. I will show you my students. Bonjour. 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 Bonjour.